everybody, David Jacobs with Accurate Dynamics. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install a nitrogen generator and then we're going to do the calibration afterwards. Okay, now that we've got our tank mounted and our nitrogen generator mounted, the first thing that we're going to do is connect our nitrogen generator to our tank. We're going to come up here with our shark bike fittings. We're going to connect this here. The next blue tube is going to go directly in here, which connects to our regulator. We're going to push that in. It locks in with the shark bite right up there. Next, we're going to connect our line from our meter right here all the way up to the top of our nitrogen generator. Next, we're going to connect our line going to our tote to the 2 PSI regulator. If you have two totes, you will get a double uh, 90 here and you can run this both to the ISO and the resin. So how this is working is we have air inlet here. We plug our air in. We want to make sure that our air inlet does not exceed 125 PSI. Next I'm going to be walking you through how to calibrate our nitrogen generator. First thing, we want to make sure that the air is plugged up and we have a little bit of air weeping out. These two side holes should come with a red plug you want to make sure and remove. First thing we want to do is turn our Pro 2 sensor on, pull our cap off, open up the brass valve all the way to the left. Once that's done, the ball should be floating. We want to float about four to six. Once you have the ball floating at four to six, you're going to go ahead and Put the cap back on the Pro O2 sensor and close the brass valve all the way to the right. We should see the number go down to about 0 0.03 which gives us 97% pure nitrogen. Once we're reading that number just go ahead and press the power button off. 